Oh shit, man. That's, that's hilarious. What's the situation back there? You guys dating? You two? How long have you been dating? Three years. Everyone make some noise. Three years. How, how'd you guys meet? College. All right, hold on to her, man. You ever see like when an old man like in his 40s and 50s and he looks like an idiot, but he got a hot wife? Because he was smart enough to hold on to her in college. Just saying, don't let her go. Ma'am, you can pay me later. <laughs> Dating is tough now. Do you guys know in the California school system, which is the UC and Cal State system, a boy has to receive consent from a girl for everything he does. I don't know if you guys knew this, this is, this is actual law. Uh, I was with a girl a couple weeks ago, and normally, as a man, I'll just grab her and kiss her. <laughs> but you can't do that shit no more. I don't want to go to jail. So I said, hey, can I kiss you? <laughs> I felt like a little bitch. <laughs> but I wanna go to jail, right? So I asked and she goes, yes. So I said, like, great, I grabbed her and I kissed her. And then I broke the kiss. And I was like, hey, while I'm kissing you, do you mind if I take my hand and put it on your shoulder? <laughs> she goes, no. I said, great. So I kissed her and I put my hand on her shoulder. Then I broke the kiss again. And I said, hey. Uh, while I'm kissing you, do you mind if I take my hand and my forearm in a rubbing motion on your back? She goes, no. I said, great. So I kissed her, I start rubbing her back, right? And then I broke the kiss again. And I, I, I asked her, hey, uh, while I'm kissing you, do you mind if I wax that ass? <laughs> I was like, this shit's ridiculous, dude, right? I got on the phone with my attorney. I had him drop a contract for me. He wrote a contract, seven-page contract of all the shit that I do in the bedroom with little toggle boxes next to it, right? So a girl can check off all the things that she wants done to her, right? I got a page as a choose your own adventure page where she selects two of the three, three of the five, five of the seven, based on how tired I am that evening, right? I got a page that asks one question. Do you like it rough? If yes, please explain. First girl I gave this to, she checked off yes, but she didn't explain. Now I don't want to go to jail, so I was like, hey, you checked off you like it rough. What do you mean? She's like, well, you can rip off my clothes. Rip off your clothes? Nah, bitch, I ain't doing that, no. Cause that shit is evidence. I don't need that shit in my life, right? She's like, come on, at least rip my panties off. I was like, mm-mm, bitch, no. I rolled her panties down nice and neat. As soon as she stepped out of them, I picked them up, unrolled them, folded the sides like so, and then tucked the bottom into that pocket that forms, you know what I'm talking about? And then I put that right on top of her clothes and I just steam pressed. I ain't risking shit for this bitch, right? Then, then while we're doing it, she's like, choke me. Choke you? Mm, bitch, no. I'm not gonna get my hand print on your neck. Fuck that shit. No, no. I got an empty pillowcase. I folded that shit nice and neat. Wrapped that shit around her neck and twisted the motherfucker. No, I ain't going to jail for this bitch. No. Everyone's sensitive right now with the whole Me Too shit. And look, I'm gonna put this shit out there. No one should be sexually assaulted or raped. If you agree, make some noise. Uh, yeah. But some motherfuckers, and I'm not saying they're, they're all white, but a lot of them are white. Uh, they will say shit like, well, she didn't mean it when she said no. I thought about this, and I was like, you yeah, know, there's some truth to that. Cause some of you ladies, your no is not a real no. It's like, no. <laughs> that shit confuses us. We're not the brightest gender in the world, right? But it's 2019, I dug deeper. I was like, okay. And then I realized, every boy in here knows what a real no sounds like. And every girl in here knows how to say a real no. The reason I know this is because every guy in here has tried to stick his dick in his girlfriend's asshole without telling her. That's a real no. No! No! The fuck you think you doing? So in conclusion, 
There are no excuses. My name is Walter Hahn. Thank you, guys.